Good morning. Okay, we had a little bit of a delayed start there. We had some technical difficulties, but we are ready to rock and roll. Finally, let me get my chat up. Here we go. And we want live chat, not top chat, because nobody uses top chat. Fuck off YouTube with top chat. We don't want it. Ah, oh, okay. We're not doing a new game. <laughs> no, we are going to continue. Hey, Psycho Ghost Rider and Tango to the Mango. Good morning. I think you both got in at the same time, but it listed you alphabetically. And W.D. Henderson, hello, good morning. Yeah, sorry for being a few minutes late. We um, were just having issues with the OBS software not recognizing either the game audio or my mic. It was like, it recognized the game audio. and uh, Sorry, it didn't recognize the game audio to begin with. And then we restarted, and then it was like, oh, yeah, yeah, game audio, we gotcha. But no, we're not going to do the microphone. So it's like, oh, fuck, okay, so we restart the PC again, and then it's fine. Just some weird glitch that I don't know how to, I don't, I don't even know what's going wrong. Like, all the hardware is working fine. I see lights, I hear myself, so I know that the, you know, it's feeding the mic into the headphones and everything, but it's just a software thing. Um, One of those weird little buggy... I don't know, a gremlin, some sort of gremlin in there. I'm going to have to do some gremlin, uh, set some gremlin traps. I don't know. I don't know what I'm saying. Let's play some Days Gone. I have had coffee. Um, I'm also weirdly on edge because yesterday, fun story, my kiddo got sent home from daycare because he pulled somebody's hair twice. And this isn't the first time he's done it. He is not enjoying his daycare experience. Um, and so we got sent home at like half past 10. Uh, can we call in an exorcist for my PC? Well, I mean, if it's demons, I can take care of that. I can do some, some shit to take it. Although knowing me, I'd probably just summon more. <laughs> um, but yeah, anyway, so I'm really paranoid. I have my phone right next to me. I'm really paranoid. Oh, look at my picture of Deacon. I don't know if you can see that. Hang on. Let me see if that comes up. I don't know if you can see my Deacon picture. But it's really cool. I like it. There it is. Um, yes, I'm really paranoid that daycare's going to call and be like, yep, he pulled someone's hair again. Because next time, next time he does it, he gets sent home for a week. <sighs> Rex says, I want to point and laugh while they sprinkle holy water on it to fix it. Well, that would probably break it. You can't sprinkle holy water, any kind of water, on electronics. Marcus, hello. I haven't seen your name in a while. And Salvador, good morning. Ma'am, are you showing Deke pics on your live stream? Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, so um, Deke, double E, pics. Feel free to send me unsolicited Deke pics at any point. Anytime you want to do that on Instagram, through Reddit. I like getting unsolicited Deke pics specifically. Not the other kind. Not the kind it sounds like, but the deke picks. We'll do deke picks. And I, I will I will flash my deke at the camera on any given day. Um, okay. <laughs> Joni, good morning. Uh let's take a look. What oh I see I see on the map I see we have a couple of freaks caught in some bear traps. That means I don't have to drive over the bear traps. Uh let's go do the MMU, or should we do the radio tower? I feel like I just did these. I did these on my other playthrough. I've I've started this game numerous times. Um, which one do you want to do? Which should we do first? <laughs> it's funny because Rex says I love sending you deke pics. Has anybody, Marcus asks, played Days Gone on Steam, Stream, Steam, Steam Deck? I know somebody on Reddit was talking about that. This was a little while ago. I don't remember. And so, no, someone in the chat was saying they were getting a Steam Deck. I don't remember who it was. Uh, I have not. Have you, Marcus? Um, let's go do the uh, 
the MMU. So, for those of you wondering, uh, knowing the, um, the Spornicus Rex situation, you know. Wolf! Sorry, Wolf. No nitrous installed. It's still running over. Um, so everyone's probably thinking, well, you know, she's, uh, she's all shacked up with Spornicus Rex. Or rather, Spornicus Rex is shacked up with me. Um, shush, Copeland. She's probably gonna do the best early game, you know, get the SMP9, do the four hordes. Because it is the smart thing to do, and we did do that on our last playthrough, because we were playing on the, um, the Drifter experience, the antisocial playthrough. Uh, we're actually not going to do that this time. We're going to play it the way I've always played it, which is to be terrified of the hordes. Anything good? Um, what, uh, am I going crazy? Where, there we go. It's like, where is my health bar? Am I playing on survival too? Did I load the wrong one? But yeah, we're not going to do the four hordes. We will do that at some point because I fucking do love the SMP9. This is it. The near a checkpoint. I got to find some shit for boozers on. Oh, shit. There's a lot of them. Yee, run away. But no, we're just going to play this in the spirit of the game, which is it. to enjoy the... Um, the the weaker early few hours, you know, when you don't know what the fuck you're doing and you don't have any good guns, you just have the shit crossbow. Not the good crossbow, the shitty crossbow. I don't no no. Fuck, they know I'm here. Oh shit. Oh shit. Eee! All right, we do have the machete though, so fuck these guys. Ah, I don't have bull rush. I keep forgetting I don't have bull rush. Holy cow, he took my health down a lot. All right. I gotta be careful because if he gets one hit in, I die. All right, let's go get that bandage that we saw back here. Oh, my stamina's out. Fuck it, we'll get the bandage in a minute. Wee! Oh, they knocked my bike over! Fucking bitch. One of you cocksuckers knocked my bike over. Is it you? Oh shit! Eee! Or is it you? It's a powerful backhand he has there. Another bounty. Alright. Uh oh. Please don't be daycare. Oh yay! It's spam risk. There's gotta be a generator here somewhere. Fuck off spam risk. Oh, my heart skipped a beat then. In a bad way when I heard my phone ring. Uh what have we got in the chat? <laughs> You'll get it when you deserve it. Mm-hmm. Uh, Joni says, good morning, Claire, as I wave at the TV when you say my name. Aw, hi, Joni. Feeble Deacon. Yeah, Mel, hello. Hello, everyone. I'm so glad we're back with Days Gone and Deke. Absolutely. Oh, Marcus, you ordered a Steam Deck last week. I want to play Days Gone everywhere. They will, oh, they will ship it in October? What the fuck? Is it, is it back-ordered or... Is it, uh, like, what? October? That's fucking crazy. Yep. It's July. That's insane. Bingo. Here it is. Rag inventory full. Yep. Guess it is. Fuel. Okay, we still have a speaker I gotta take care of, but uh, we can do this first. Need this. 
Hey, gamer newbie Ed, haven't seen you in a minute. Hello, good morning everyone. I hope everyone is having an amazing day. You too. How are you? It's been a while. All right, I think we are good. Look at this, I love this. Ouch. An axe to the face so deep that the axe is still stuck in there, defying gravity. That is wedged in there. I would, can you imagine pulling that out and being like, I want this axe and having to pull it out of somebody's face? Nah, thanks. Come on, you son of a bitch, you better I'll leave start. it. That's why I like the machetes. Yes. I don't have to pull them out of people's faces. Sterile bandages, sterile bandages. Where the hell would they keep this shit? Okay, we got a med kit, so we might as well, yeah, as well pick that up. This. I always think that this thing looks like the uh, the hoverboard from Back to the Future 2. Every time I'm like, hoverboard? Oh, no. Yes, sterile bandages. Just what the doctor ordered. Now I just gotta get this back to Boozer. Oh, hello. I love that Deacon just sees that and is like, "Oh, free drugs? Okay. What's this? <laughs> let's do that. Uh, let's go focus. I'm going to uh, alternate so stamina and focus, because last time we just did focus, which was clever until we got to Carlos. I saw on Reddit yesterday someone is planning a playthrough, or just started a playthrough, uh, where they are not using... What is it? Not using Nero injectors? And... Um, something else. Not using neuro injectors and... Oh, not using skills. Not adding skill points. Not using the skill points. It's like, damn. I know it can be done, but ooh, that's going to be... The Carlos thing is going to be a challenge because I struggled with that. Oh, no. I missed the side. Is there anything in here? Oh, yeah. Here we go. Um, it's probably yeah. the... Oh, no, the tech. Okay. I'm, yet again, not going to be picking up collectibles and um, the the uh, audio recordings and stuff. We'll leave those. Okay. What are we doing? We have no primary. We just have this and the crossbow. Oh. Hang on a minute. Gamer Newbie Ed says, Sorry, I had to deal with an internet issue, aka a stalker. Um. Uh, Rex asks, Is getting the machete when you leave only remounting considered cheating? No. Why would it be cheating? It's right there. Why is it cheating? Cheating is when you play on PC and it gives you the Drifter crossbow and Nitrous 1 already installed. That's cheating. I'm kidding. Not really. Uh, let's go kill some starving patriots or whatever the fuck. Now, question. While we're here... Boozer, you there? I know that, um... Boozer, God damn it, answer me. The... Whatchamacallit? The horde down here hasn't spawned yet. They don't spawn until a lot later. Um... But is the, is the good loot down here, is the question. Of course it would be. It's not like the Horde brings the loot. Let's pick it up. Ooh, hello. Tasty, tasty, kerosene, scrap, mines. It's a neat little stop off. Well, anyway, Ed, I hope everything's okay. I, I don't know if you're... I don't know how serious you are. I don't know how serious it's been. Uh, but stalkers are no joke. That's uh, not a fun situation. Are we... Oh, I must have picked up a bandage. Okay. I'll save that one for later. 
Oh shit, I need gas. Well. I'm sure there'll be gas at the... Uh, there is, there's gas up at the... Uh, this camp up here. Yep, alright, whatever. Wait, where am I going? This way? Map leading me the right way. Where is this map leading me? No, see, I knew it was leading me the wrong way. I knew, I knew where I was going. Oh shit, we're low on gas. Oh my word. Where am I? Where? What? I've driven this so many times. I know this way. I don't know how we're getting lost this morning. See, they hear the bike and they all come running. And then they get a Molotov. Come on, stand in a nice little group. Go look at oh four five of you. Everything's fine. Just shut up. Six of you. Oh my so word. Anything? Hey. Something's out here. Shit. Oh yeah, we got him. Got oh, he knocked my bike over. Oh. All right, that's three of them with one Molotov. Sweet. And they don't even know I'm here. Now what? Now what? Now what do we do? Yeah, Game and Newbie Ed. I missed you guys. Such a great community of awesome people. We missed you. You are awesome people. Shit, gotcha. Freaks. Oh, no, no. oh, great. Awesome. Yeah. Oh, no. Fun with that. Yeah, we oh. Too many. Good, good. Okay, I thought they were going to die a lot more than that. Huh? Right here. Waiting to stab you in the neck. Hiding in these bushes? Mm-hmm. Yep. What was that? Go, 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 go. Deacon, 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 go. Hide. There we go. Yeah. Oh no, your buddy fell over. Is he taking a nap? You should go check on him. You totally go check on him. Or hide behind a tree. Honestly, if your friend who's behind you is suddenly dead, you probably should hide. I think he heard that. Oh shit. Oh, he's right there. Don't rustle too loud. Gotcha. Whew. All right. That was a Dude, we got half of them. That's what happens when you just drive the bike up a little too close. They just all come running. Oh, now we got freaks. Okay. No, I didn't want that one. Okay, here we go. Okay, where is everyone else? Where do we... Did we kill the guy fixing the car? I don't... See him, I think we got those two. Okay, somebody's here on the map. Where the fuck are they? Oh, there she is. Sorry, lady. 
six. I love how the fire kind of obscures your view, like it, especially the the way it's really bright and it makes it hard to see sort of around it. This one on the map. Oh, 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 oh. Where are you? Where the fuck are you? Where is he? Oh, cool. He is still fixing the car. Don't mind me. I'm not really here. So we got. Oh, that guy is still there. That fucking asshole. Yeah. This guy never comes to investigate. Hey, Quasimoto! Alright, hang on. I need to catch up with the chat. Um... <laughs> Spornicus Rex says, Hey, I can't help that you get Nitro and the Drifter Crossbow only on the PC. Talk to Bend if you think that's cheating. <laughs> um... Then why is it cheating to get the SMP? No, I didn't... I didn't mean... It's not cheating. Did I say cheating? I didn't mean to say cheating. It's not really cheating. Um, it's just... For me, it's not my play style because I like to, I like to be weak and underpowered and enjoy the chaos of the world. It doesn't feel natural to suddenly jump to one of the best weapons in the game. I like to earn it a little more. Um, oh yeah, uh, so we have a Discord now. Ed, definitely you should get on that. Um, and uh, we will post a link. It's kind of tricky to post links. I know Rex doesn't have the current link. I don't think I have the current link in my description uh, of the channel. I don't think I have the right one. Um, but check yesterday's live stream. Um, you'll see the, the link in there. Um, and if any of the other mods who have the link come on throughout the stream, they will post it. Um, we also have merch. We have t-shirts, long sleeve tees, tanks, um, stickers, Mugs, buttons, um, what else do we have? Art prints. We have two different designs. One is called Drifter's Arsenal, and it's a really cool... In fact, I'm wearing it right now. Hang on, let me see if I can... Let's see if I can show you. I don't know how well this is going to go. It's a uh, design of a bunch of the weapons that you'll find in Deacon's inventory. The, what do we have? The the crossbow, little stubby, his hat, his boot knife, fuel can, uh, the saw blade axe. Um, what else we got? His ring, the one percent patch, his radio, the Chicago chopper, napalm molotov, a lighter, Sarah's ID badge, sprig of lavender. Tons of cool stuff. Uh, so we have that one. And then we have the fuck schizo design, which says fuck schizo. And that one's based on Schizo's basketball jersey that he wears. So it has like the number 32. It's really fucking cool. Um, both of them are available in a bunch of different colors. And uh, we have men's and women's uh, and kids. We have kids stuff, uh, like kids t-shirts. Um, and like I said, art prints and things like that you can get as well. I have a bulldog clip clipped to my shorts. Forgot that was there. Uh, what, oh, sorry. I missed other stuff in the chat. And uh, other than waiting on the SMP9, are you doing any other rules? Nah, I think we're just going to play this as I normally play it. And that's really kind of like why I'm not getting the SMP9, because that's not my playstyle, that's the Spornicus Rex playstyle. And it is excellent. It is the best way to play this game if you want to be really, like, um, badass from the beginning. Whereas I like to, I like to have feeble deke. 
Um, okay. Quasi! G'day, Bear Trap Tribe! It stays gone with breakfast b before coffee. <laughs> uh, Rex, did you fix the pretty lady breakfast first? No, I actually, I haven't, I haven't had breakfast. But we do have a new microphone and everything set up with, um, very little background noise. So no more rager bears from my stomach. Oh, Game on EBN! The Uncharted 2 is your favourite of the first three. Awesome, that's the one we're playing at the moment. We are not quite halfway through. We're just getting to the train part. So yeah, come hang out on Tuesdays. Uh, go, Psycho Ghost Rider, you're the same way you like to earn your power. Yeah. I think, Rex, you're asking if you can search for it on Discord. So Discord has this thing where it's not searchable or something to begin with until we're a little more established. I don't know if that means we need more people on it or if it needs to have existed for longer. Mr. Dutchy Dutch, hello. Uh, Sponicus Rex says, my style is how you play if you want to be overpowered early. Claire's style is how you play to just enjoy the chaos of the world. Yeah. Honestly, if I could just be underpowered throughout the whole thing, that would be fun too. But mm, also, um, I don't know if I'm brave enough to do that. Let's see if we can kill this guy. Gotcha. Did you see me? Oh shit, where's he going? Where you going mate? You don't know where I am. You don't know. Do you know? I hate this bit. I hate getting stuck here. Oh, look at the way the light is coming through there. Look at that. It's a bad spot to be in. Poor visibility, but... It's beautiful. Alright, there's that mofo. Let's get him. Or her. Hey, who do we have? Mr. Dutchy Dutch, and it's unanimous. Hello. Someone's out here. <laughs> Jay Stabby says, I, I am still, I still feel feeble early game, even with the oh. SMP9, because I'm a terrible shot. You just got to get the um, focus, focus on focus. What is that? You should come check it out. Oh, someone's throwing it's rocks. Something. Gotcha. <laughs> okay, did that... Can I go back to fixing his car? Okay, someone else said I saw something. No, you didn't. How many? I don't know why it's not showing up. Eight of ten. Okay. So we have that guy over there fixing the car. And then there must be one guy left inside the camp. So let's take out this guy. Sorry, Where's dude. Coming from? Oh, shit. I know you're just a mechanic and everything, but... <laughs> I just shrug. I was like, I don't care. Ooh! Oh, we can't... Oh, we don't have field repairs yet. Fuck. Alright, how close are we to getting our next skill? Halfway. I think, if I'm reading that right. <clears throat> That's what that means. Hey, where is this person? Hmm. 
Oh, I see him over there. I see him. Hang on, I'm just checking my messages. Every time my phone buzzes, I'm like paranoid at stake here. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's see if we can get a headshot. No. I think it is the the problem with this crossbow. Oops, is the fall the the fall off the drop off? Because that hit them in the shoulder, and I was still aiming high. Do you see me? Well, now I know where they are. I can sneak up on them. I see you hiding like a little bitch. Gotcha. Jesus, Cope, how many men have you pissed off? That was fun. Ah, uh, there we go. I was like, there was a body over here I didn't loot. I remember that. Know. All right. This has got to be the generator, but it's been there it is. shot to hell. Ah, full up on everything. Okay, that should do it. There we go. Drop it! Uh, if you had bullets, I wouldn't be breathing now, would I? Please, mister. I don't shoot women if I have a choice. Do I have a choice? I ain't got nothing. I got, I got nowhere, nowhere to, go. to go. <laughs> uh, Mr. Dutchy Dutch, I just got a 55 inch 4K TV and it looks sweet on my games. Yeah, that's that's exactly how I'm playing. My new setup is so awesome. I have a big TV and I have it so that it doesn't show the camera on my screen. Um, so I can see it full screen, which is really nice. Oh, you were playing GTA 5 on it, and damn! Hey, James Guan! Good morning! Good morning, good morning. Uh, the crossbow kind of sucks. I like blowing their bloody heads off. Yeah. Uh, Joni says, Spawnicus Rex, you showed how to use photo mode to scout situations. Cannot seem to do that with the PS5. Is there a way, or is it not possible? Yeah, it, sh it should be possible. Um, so this is PS5 that we're playing on, so you just go photo mode. I mean, it should just be the same as PS4. It is on, um, the PlayStation, the camera is a lot more sort of close and fixed to Deacon. Uh, but you can go to, if you go to field of view, so if you press R1 once, changes the bottom right, and go to field of view and put it straight all the way to the right. And then you can kind of see a lot more. But yeah, that should that should work for you, same as on PlayStation 4. PC, I think, if I remember correctly, has like a slightly wider field of view. Here's the hatch, yeah. I knew you had one. Uh, so on PC, it's even easier. 
Hey, Joe Schmo. Good morning. Uh, Joe, while you're here, could you please drop the link for the Discord in the chat? Sorry to jump on you straight away. Um, but we were talking about it earlier. Gamer Newbie Ed is with us and would like to join the Discord. And I don't have the link and Rex doesn't have the link. And also, um, if you wouldn't mind, when you have a second, sorry. Uh, could you explain, is it searchable yet? I don't know if we can actually search for the Discord. Thank you for dropping that link in there. Um, yeah, I don't know if it's like searchable or if it's still weird. I don't really know the ins and outs of Discord. What do we got here? How to craft the, okay, yeah. Okay. Dick, you there? It's probably nothing. You sounded like bike engines, riding somewhere on the mountain. I just finished clearing the radio tower. I'm, I'm gonna climb the tower, uh, see if I can see anything. Quasi says... Right, didn't we have a discussion once that there's content cut from the game here that the player themselves would have got to make a decision to let her go or kill her? Yeah, so there used to be... It was originally designed to be a decision tree game, I, I I don't know for sure, but I believe that in the scene with Leon, you can really see that would be the first moment where you get to make a decision. You know, the bit where he's looking down at, D, at, at Leon and um, Leon's like, you know, what are you waiting for? Do it. Um, goddamn liar. And Deke's face has like a really emotionally torn expression. I always read that. Originally, before I knew it was a decision tree, as um, he was kind of emotionally torn and thinking about the hardness of this world, and then is like pushes it down, is like nah, fuck it, and kills him. But in reality, I think that was supposed to be a pause on Deacon's face. Text comes up: Do you want to, you know, press square to kill Leon? Press triangle to let him go. Um, hey, Deke, kind of okay. moment. You don't sound like. Like yourself. Booze is so it's, perceptive. Uh, you know, I just I love that drifter get the drop on me. Lucky for me, she was uh, out of ammo. You let her go, didn't you? Okay. Yeah, so Yes, yes, I let her go. In this moment that code of yours is gonna get you killed. Yeah, well, something's gonna do huh. it, right? Doesn't In this moment what? this conversation would have gone differently. Jesus, would have gone differently if he'd killed her. Because Boozer would be like, you sound different, you don't sound like yourself. And he'd be like, yeah, some drifter just got the drop on me. And maybe Boozer would say, you know, did you let her go? And Deke was like, nah, fucking killed that bitch. Or, I don't know, whatever he would have said. Like, no, I couldn't take the, couldn't take the, the risk. Um, hang on, let me catch up, let me catch up. Yeah, so it would have impacted how the end game played out. So definitely Boozer, spoilers by the way, uh, Boozer surviving or dying would have been based on your interactions with him, based on how much you help him find Jack and things like that, you know, and like help lift him out of his funk versus ignoring him. You know, that mission where you go to talk to him when he's at the farm and he's like, yeah, no, I don't want to talk. That could have been a moment that sort of inspires you to say, well, fuck you too, Boozer. And then you don't do boozer missions, and then he dies because he gets suicidal. Um, versus if you're like, oh, poor boozer is having a real bad day. He doesn't even want to talk to Deke. Let me do something nice for him. And then it leads you to the conclusion that he lives. Um, Rex says, on PC, you can customize the field of view for general gameplay. I like it maxed out because it prevents motion sickness when gaming for long hours. Mm -hmm. It also just gives you a better field of view. That's why I like third part. I know you're... Rex, you're a first-person kind of player, but I like third-person because I like to be able to... It's almost like having peripheral vision. I like to be able to see what's coming up on the side of me. I find first-person is like with blinkers on. It, it doesn't make sense. I can only see a very small field of view. Um, Obscured by Ink said... Okay, oh wait, hang on. Uh... Yeah, Obscure Bank says, I experienced something new last night playing Days Gone. I killed the Westfer Horde and the wind was blowing like crazy. Maybe I never noticed it, but the wind was so crazy. Ah. Oh. I mean, the weather in this is super dynamic. Um, but I don't think I've ever noticed it just be windy. Normally it's windy and rainy at the same time. But could happen. 
So Joe Schmo says about the Discord, it is currently not searchable. I still need to do the research on what exactly that entails. Should be able to get those answers to us tomorrow morning. Cool. I mean, no rush. We're, we're good with the link for right now, but um, yeah, at some point we'll figure that out. Rex says, I would have loved a decision tree in Days Gone. I do enjoy games that let you influence events and story. Linear story games are generally not exciting to me without a great story. Ah, I'm kind of the opposite. I like decision tree Good games, line. but um All right. Let's see what the hell Wizards talking about. But honestly, about. it it's such a huge game. I would be We're right. Someone's overwhelmed. I see smoke from their campfire. With the idea that you could have a different Someone outcome and trying to figure out what that is over the 90 out plus hours no, I put into each game. Boozer, got to get your arm healed up so we can ride the hell out of here. I'll take care of him. Every single playthrough up until this week, I've always had bad enough. weather when climbing up here. I thought it was programmed to do that, and it just gets all super, super fucking windy and rainy just to scare you climbing up here. But here we are. Almost nice, there. pretty yeah, sunny day. Keep going. Almost there. Bit of thunder on the horizon. Oh, shit, Hang on. Wait, me. Mr. Dutchy Dutch. You're really... Wow, Claire, you're really going into it. Oh, the, um, the decision tree? Oh no, my phone. Oh, it's spam risk again. Fuck off spam risk. Um, it's unanimous says, yeah, there's also the choice to take Boozer's shotgun or leave it. Yeah, we found that out in the last playthrough, that Boozer's shotgun is sitting right there. Oh, wait. You're talking about in the beginning. Oh. Yeah, 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 at the beginning, when Boozer says, I feel naked without it. Ah. Yeah, that would have, like, that would have affected Boozer's mental state. But also, because he has it later, I guess you could have given it back to him later, but he pulls it on you. Um, Quasi says that would have made replays a lot more interesting, not unlike Detroit Become Human. I was constantly trying to make the right slash best choices but sometimes there was no best choice. Um, oh no. Hang on, let me get this. One second. Hello? Okay, I think the uh, the mic is on. Um, that was <laughs> that was the AC company coming to do a, a just a little fix on the air conditioning. Um, okay, where are we in the chat? Where do we get to? Yeah, Jay Stabby, I spend too much time agonizing over each decision and wondering what I'm changing. Mm -hmm. On my favorite games, says Rex, I'll play them multiple times just to explore each decision tree. Yeah, I mean, I'll just play this multiple times anyway. Um, What did we want? Field repairs, right? We got focus shot. Field repairs. There we go. Boom. Now we can repair our machete and pick up the scrap. scrap Sweet. Good. There was more scrap up the ladder, but fuck climbing back up there. I think we may have had more scrap up. Over here, there we go. There's eight. Got any scrap? No. That's fine, there's plenty of scrap. We are not going to be hurting for scrap. Ah, uh, we do need gas. Oh, and we can pick up those. Oh, and the assholes knocked my bike over, didn't they? 
Oh, Josh Moe, the infamous series is full of decision trees. Okay. Yeah, I just don't like to feel like I'm missing out. No, Deacon, this. You know, missing out on, like, a better ending or a different ending or something like that. Good. Wait, did that not fill it up all the way? Oh, yeah, we did. Okay. Um, all right. Take the sterile bandages to Booza. Mm, we could do that. We could go explore a little bit. We could go do the death train. St. John to Copeland's camp. It's done. The radio tower's locked down. Restored your radio uplink. Copy that. You may not see the value in St. John, but Radio Free Oregon is the only thing keeping us from turning the into only savages. The only thing now, Cope, the only is Copeland's po podcast. About nine square feet Can you imagine if I was the arrogant? The only thing days. keeping civilization so together is the Days Gone podcast. Well, sir, Listen to me talk about Booza and Sarah and Deacon. Radio Free Oregon. Jesus, what have I done? Man, great. What have you done? Why'd they bury this shit out here again? Oh, yeah, because they're assholes. This is Radio Free Oregon. And here we go. She didn't take him long, did it? Today. All right, let's see, what do we have? We have a bunch of Molotovs, we have a pipe bomb, we have a proximity mine, and we have an attractor. I feel like I should have more, but... I hate this horde. Uh oh. Okay. Oh, fuck, I hate this horde. Yep, I am just hiding behind a rock because I'm scared. Oh, I hate it when they drop down like that. Stop doing that. Um. Oh, shit. Hang on. I missed, I missed some of the chat. Sometimes it doesn't scroll for me. It's weird. Uh, okay, Joe, we have an issue with the link. Oh, there's a new one. Okay. Joni says, the scene where they are tracking Leon has slightly different dialogue before Ben wanted to cut time. The scene actually made more sense before the cuts, yeah. It's unanimous says, I wish Sucker Punch got to make its original idea for Infamous 3. Quasi says, the ending with Boozer was a bit cliche. Isn't there a movie along those lines too? Oh, I think it was maybe a Stephen King book. Ah, <laughs> Obscure Bang, you can do it! The sword always seems harder than it should be. Yeah. Oh shit, I missed him. Alright, that's a few of them down. And I need to heal. <sighs> I 
I'm still I'm still avoiding it. I'm still like da da da. Let's pick up some shit. That's all the ammo I have. Great. I have a feeling this isn't going to go well. Come on, boys. Come on. I get you. All right, that'll pull him out. Hi, I'm here. Ooh, shit. There we go. Maybe a little overkill. Maybe I didn't need to use the mine, the Molotov. But shit, I mean, we've got tons of stuff to pick up here, so. If it gets the job done, it gets the job done. Wait, where am I going? Okay, so while it's daytime, let's get this MMU unlocked. Because this place, even after you take out the horde, is always crawling with freaks. I would like to find a different way to do this horde, where um, maybe use more of the explosives down here. But it just seems kind of pointless when you can get more with that truck. Let's get some scrap. Quasi, you gotta go. Thank you for being here. Should have done that first. unanimous as that was clean. That was the best I've ever done it, to be honest. That was the cleanest I have ever done that. Like I said, you can maybe do it a lot more efficiently, uh, but oh, look at that. Look at that um, growler sitting right there. Wish you could pick that shit up. Aw, thank you, Rex. Clean? That was spotless. Do we have one over here? No. got in here? Deacon, what do we have in the box? Deacon, Deacon St. John, you will open that box right now. Good boy. Ammo. And bandage and bottle. Yee.
Ah. I'll do all that in a minute. Um. Did I miss any? I feel like I've missed at least one. Can we get them all? Do we want to find out the hard way? We got that one. And we got the ones on top of the MMU. Is that it? I'm convinced I've missed one. Well, fuck it. We'll turn it off in a second. <laughs> Deacon, okay, Mom, jeez. I'm doing it. Leave me alone. Yes. I get them all? Alright, I got them all. Alright, here we go. Yes. Alright, so we're gonna alternate stamina, focus, stamina, focus. Just so we're up with the. for the Carlos fight. Mm. <clears throat> Better living through chemistry. Through chemistry. Gun locker. Box of nails. Free med kit. Hey, don't slash the med kit, Deacon. Oh no, now the phone's ringing again. Hang on one sec. I'm going to be right back. One minute. Talk amongst yourselves.
I'm back. Sorry about that. Okay. I just... Oh, no, it's nighttime. I just left it unpaused. Did I get attacked? <laughs> Did I miss anything? Okay. Let me just check. Are we... Mike is on, right? I think Mike is on. <laughs> it's Unanimous says, Watching other people play Days Gone always makes me want to play Days Gone. Yep. <laughs> I'm skipping. Oh shit, she didn't pause. Incoming Freaker. Oh, uh, yeah, I got some. Um... I can't believe I didn't pause it. I just got kerfluffled. There was someone at the door. Uh, what were we doing? We did this already. Okay. Mm, cool. Let's go do the White King Mine. As soon as we're here. Uh, where is it? It's about. Here ish? Oh, and of course, it's night time. Oh! <gasps> Do I, while Spornicus Rex isn't watching, maybe we should sleep and make it morning? Let's do that. Again, I'm just gonna grab I don't normally sleep, but you know, early game. Let's just, let's just do it. Uh, okay, here we go. Here's morning. Okay, let's go. I love his little... Oh, okay, let's go. Let's go get it done. Uh-oh. <clears throat> now, in my defense, because I, like I said, I don't normally sleep, uh, but I did leave it paused, uh, unpaused, while I stepped away. So I'll allow a little concession. Actually, let's just save it. There we go. No nitrous installed. God damn it. I remember being so scared of this region this, this specific little part of the map up here when I first played it because I would come through the tunnel here wherever it is here and just be like ambushed all the time and any time I came up here I just felt like uh wait where are we going which way yeah I just felt like I was always getting myself in trouble ah this is their feeding ground raider camp yeah. You mean sons of bitches, aren't you? Okay, that's yeah, the Jefferson Rail Tunnel. Week, huh? Camp. I think it's this way. Ooh, and we have a little. What's going on here? What do we have? What the? Oh, red. What have we got? Red fabric. Okay, is this a Ooh. trap? Is this a trap? Oh yeah, it is. Uh, yeah, oh nice shit! Bunch of rapists, thieves, and <gasps> oh shit! No, I didn't want to get in a fight. Why don't you follow me and come get taken out by a horde? No. Okay. Damn, that was that was painful. Oh shit. Alright, fuck him. For anyone looking for a machete, there's also one in the shack here. So if you're up in this area. Machete! Mine's at 100%. Um, yeah, uh, maybe we shouldn't do this because I've used all my shit. Yeah, we're not going to do this one. Fuck it. I'm going to reload. Uh, yeah, that's the one. Poor bike always getting knocked over. My poor little Rafe. Okay. Alright, so we're... 
Excuse me. We're not going to go do the White King Mine, so let's go... Let's... Fuck it. Let's go over to Belknap and um, go pick up some loot, open up Marion Forks. We're facing the right way. No nitrous installed. Let's go do it. <clears throat> I do actually like how, um, oh shit, I like spending a little more time early game just sort of bootling around. Come on Deke, move the car, move the car, move the car. Hmm. I always used to play kind of uh, just following the missions and just doing, you know, take boost of the bandages. Oh shit, no! Ah! God fucking damn it. Fucking wolf. Yeah, you better run. There we go. I gotta reload. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. Oh no, we're gonna die. We're gonna die. We're gonna die. We're gonna die. Get on the bike, get on the bike, get on the bike, get on the bike. Run, 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 run! Oh shit! <laughs> okay. Fuck this. I'm reloading again. I don't care. We're <laughs> we are gonna get through this tunnel without be murdered by wolves. Okay, Rex has got to go. Yeah, he's uh, dealing with the tradesman, the AC tech who just showed up. <clears throat> so I can stay and hang out with all you lovely people. Okay, no wolves this time. Oh, mother bitch. Fucking, fucking shit. Come at me now with no arm, bitch. Ah. <sighs> hey, Joni, you finally made it onto Discord. Nice. <sighs> Jay Sabby says, am I the only one that never remembers I have nitrous unless I have to jump something. Oh my god, I use it all the time. There's another one. There we go. Whew. Good job there's some scrap here. And here. Yeah, this is like advanced tunneling. Uh, like the first tunnel is scary, but actually not too bad once you've once you've cleared it. It's okay And then this tunnel is like don't go through here until you really are comfortable with the game Because this tunnel will fuck you up early game Hmm <clears throat> Oh, we have another MMU we can do. Eee, I can get around this. I always crash into that K-Rail. Another mobile medical unit. Oh, I gotta find a way inside. See if there's a... See if there's another injector. <laughs> Deke's got hooked. He's like, oh, I gotta get some of that sweet, sweet chemistry. Do 
Jay Stabby made it to Chicago. See you all later. Enjoy the rest of the stream. Enjoy Chicago. <clears throat> Obscure bank, you're a nitrous aholic. <laughs> yeah, I hear that. Up, Deacon, up. Thank you. Oops. And of course, this is where we're introduced to the fuses. <laughs> Fuse, yes. And this always makes you feel like the um, oh, Nero MMUs are going to get Fuse more blown. difficult. You know, as you <laughs> go. Business. Uh, do it. Fuel is there. There we go. Here we go. You know, because it's like you open a couple just normally and now you have to go get Fuse and some of the others you have to Good. fix them and it just feels like they're going to get progressively more complicated. Oh, yes. But they don't. Which is good. There really better be something in here with all this trouble. It's a med kit. An injector. Nero had all the good shit. Game of newbie ed, I definitely have to play this again from scratch. Fuck yeah. How many playthroughs have you done now? Do the trick. Not much to pick up at this one. Did we get all the loot? Who is there? Oh, shit. Alright, fuck it. I'm out. Bye, bitches. No nitrous installed. Another nest zone. I gotta burn this shit down and make it safer. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we nest. know. Gotta be right here. Okay, we got some stuff. We got a proximity bomb, a tractor bomb, and a proximity mine. A uh, med kit, some ammo. Sweet. Uh, and a lot of fucking freaks. Okay. I kind of wasn't expecting that many, but sure. Let's go burn out this nest. Where is it? God damn nest. It's gotta be close. Oh, look at them all standing there. Hi, boys. See ya. And now I'm going to peace out. Bye. We'll get the rest of the nest later. It's quite busy over here. gonna leave that guy to sort himself out. Do we have loot up here? Baseball bat. A uh, tree. Uh, six says game of newbie, but mostly new game plus. Did that guy survive? Oh yeah, he's still there. Alright, cool. Well, let's, uh, see if he'll deal with 
some more freaks. Here you go, mate. Have them. I'm just like, hi, da di da di da. Why don't we get trapped in here? Let's leave. Run around the block. Where'd that guy go? Where are you, matey boy? Oh, did he get killed? Oh, yeah, he did. What you got? A rag. Okay, let's leave! Oh my word, it's busy here. Okay. Alright, it is 9.30 a.m. Hey, Young 2, are you finding Lisa? No, we are um, just unlocking some some of the map. I came over here to go to the farmhouse to get the hidden loot that's up here in this farmhouse right here. <clears throat> Actually, I should go to, um, let's go to the hotel as well. I should be going there. Whoa. Sorry, dude. Ah! Oh, no. Oh, no. No. <laughs> I forgot to heal. No. Okay, hang on. Hang on. Where are... What... Do we have... Okay, cool. We do have the stuff we picked up. Oh, thank God. Okay. Gotta be close to a nest. Whew, I can smell it. Alright, let's leave them all sleeping for a minute. Oh, actually, I can get some fuel while I'm here. Off the tank. Might as well. And can you heal? You can't heal while you're on the fuel pump. There we go. Let's get what we can from in here. There it is. We can use this. I hear a horn. That's weird. There it is. Oops. Hmm. Oh god, how do you get out of binoculars? There we go. Forgot the buttons for a second. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Hey, another pipe bomb. Um, let's just go see if we can see if that horde is still there. Because they can be kind of glitchy sometimes. Yeah, I hear them. If they can go down by the lake, that's the best place to get them. We have enough stuff. We have an attractor, an attractor bomb, proximity bomb, proximity mine, a grenade. I mean, a grenade would do it, and a few molotovs. So if we can get them grouped up by the uh, by the lake, that would be ideal. Shadow Lake, yeah. Hey, hey, Dandy Denny. Oh, Young Two says best live stream any days gone live stream. Yeah. <laughs> 
Yep. Come on, boys. I don't want to get seen by any stragglers, but I don't want to be too far away from them and have them, like, despawn or something. So we're just going to be nice and steady. Let's use a bit of photo mode. Let's see where they're going. Yep, they're going over the hill. boys. Can you imagine doing this in real life behind an entire fucking horde and you're like, let's creep up on them. Really hope they're going down by the lake. What day is it? 12, so they shouldn't, I mean, honestly, this horde should not be out at all. They're going back home, aren't they? Back to that little cave, that little den of iniquity. Okay, don't see me. I'm thinking we use an attractor, group them up, lob a grenade, mop up who's left. We've got the uh, SAF with 50, 50 rounds, one for each member of the horde, honestly. All right, let's see if we can just group them up here. Oh shit, half the horde's down there. Fuck. Fuck. This isn't gonna go well. Let's use a few Molotovs. Keep them busy. Nah, this I fucked this. I didn't realize how spread out they were. Aim is off. Oh shit, no focus. Ah! Yeah, this has gone wrong. This went horribly wrong. It was doomed from the beginning. Ah, well, we'll see if. Uh... Okay, well. Bounty. Did we kill something? Is half the horde dead? We're getting, uh. Aunties. Yeah, you just, you need them to be grouped up. If they're not grouped up, it ain't gonna work. I hear a wolf. Sometimes there's cool shit to pick up here. Not today. Oh, hi. Yeah, see, it reloaded us after we'd used that ship. Fuck. Okay. <sighs> we'll reload it. What time do we want to re- There's a lot of- Yeah, that's where we started engaging the horde. Let's reload it to here. Well, that was a shame. I was hoping we could group them up, but they just get so spread out. Half of them didn't even uh, 
react to the attractor. Alright, let's go get our loot. And then I think I'm going to call it for today. Oh, shit, what's happening here? Okay. It is getting late. What's this? Since we've got a free Molotov right there. Look at me, I'm just I can't help but get into trouble, can I? Yeah, freakers burn. Oh shit. Marauders of some description. So, fun fact, if I'm in the right place, this is Tucker's old house. It's a collectible you pick up in here, I believe. And there's always a suppressor in this car. Primary suppressor. Where the collect isn't there a collectible in here somewhere? Yeah, here it is. And this lets you know. Yeah. This lets you know it's her house. And I like that she has like a uh, a vegetable garden. Like she was really into gardening. She had a greenhouse. Kind of a different view of Tucker. Oh, we don't need a machete. Okay. All right. I am going to call it here for today. Um, as always, thank you everyone for watching. I appreciate you all. Let's do a save. Okay. We need to alternate. It's always best to alternate your saves so you have one uh, a backup in case you're primary save fails um okay so it is wednesday uh i will be back here tomorrow morning same time 8 a.m mountain time so we're now on mountain time schedule and uh, oh anton g hello sorry you came in right at the end but hi good to have you here uh so yes yeah, so we're going to be doing 8 a.m monday through friday and 8 p.m on sundays is zombie army trilogy so i get my sniper Sniper Elite on, um, but with some zombies, because I love a good zombie game and, you know, horror in general. So, yeah, so come back tomorrow morning, 8 a.m. on this channel, and, uh, well, obviously on this channel, and then 8 p.m. on Sunday. Uh, funeral wrap-up things. You can support the channel and the podcast at buymeacoffee.com slash daysgonepod. You can buy merch, uh, T-shirts. And all that good stuff, t-shirts, pins, mugs, art prints, long sleeve tees, tanks, men's styles, women's styles, kids, all sorts of different colors. Check it out. It's at daysgonepodcast.threadless.com. And we also have a Discord. Joe Schmo just dropped the link in the chat right there. Uh, check it out. Come join Discord. Come chat with us when we're not streaming. Um, cool. All right. Well, as always, stay safe out there, and I will see you tomorrow. Bye.